When it comes to productivity in communal space, the volume of accessories matters a lot, specifically in open space work environments where people don't realize how annoying loud clicking noise can be. This is where the MX Master 3S from Logitech outshines its predecessor. With a significantly higher DPI and quieter clicking noise, this mouse is as tranquil as an accessory can get. In this video, we will unbox, test, and review it to see whether it lives up to its potential. So without further chatter, let's get started. The mouse comes in minimal packaging where it contains the mouse itself, a wireless dongle, a USB 3.0 to USB-C cable, and some documents. Priced at around $100, Master 3S is a remastered model of the previous Master 3 mouse that has a similar price tag. Naturally, Master 3S boasts the identical design to Master 3 with some performance tweaks. It comes in three color variants, and the one we have right here is the graphite model. 3S has a thumb rest on the left and a total of eight buttons, three on the thumb, two click, and one on the scroll wheel. The two additional buttons include a mode shift button on the upper middle of the mouse and an easy switch button on the bottom of the mouse. It also has the iconic scroll wheel on the thumb for horizontal scrolling. Spec-wise, you get up to 8,000 DPI on this mouse and 2.4 gigahertz wireless connectivity. The operating distance stretches as far as 10 meters, and a 500 milliampere battery is used to power it up. After using it for a couple of weeks, we gotta say that the 3S is noticeably quieter than the previous MX Master 3. It does that without sacrificing tactility, as we felt the exact point when a click was being registered. With double the DPI range from the previous one, the mouse felt quite responsive but we had to adjust the DPI setting from the software as the mouse defaults to 1000 DPI out of the box. As mentioned earlier, the mode shift button for the scroll wheel works wonderfully. We were able to precisely go through line by line in the ratchet mode, while the free spin mode let us fly through larger vertical documents such as an Excel sheet like a breeze. In either of these models, the scroll wheel felt super satisfying to use. The horizontal scroll wheel was always on the reach and quite practical while scrolling horizontally through Adobe Premiere Pro timeline. We were also able to seamlessly adjust the brush size in Adobe Photoshop using it. The most amazing thing about the Master 3S is its device switching mode that lets you juggle between three different devices. As we often work with multiple devices with varying platforms such as Windows and Mac, this feature worked like a charm. We were also able to drag a file from one system and drop it down to another, which made file transferring real simple. All these features can also be fine-tuned manually via the dedicated software. From here, we could adjust the scroll sensitivity, customize each button, and set macro commands to make productive sessions more efficient. And lastly, the battery backup on this thing is superb. Logitech promises about 70 days of use with just a single charge but in our one week testing, it still had about 80% juice left, so you can expect more from it. However, there are some limitations. With a weight of about 141 grams, the mouse feels quite heavy. It also has a slightly lower polling rate, so you might feel the latency. Due to the large size of the mouse, people with smaller hands might face difficulty using it in a palm or claw grip style. MX Master 3S is undoubtedly an awesome mouse for productivity at this price range. The scroll wheel is satisfying as ever, and the low noise operation will also appeal to most users' preferences. So that was all about the MX Master 3S. Thanks for watching. If you found this video helpful, give it a thumbs up, share it with your friends, and comment below to let us know your thoughts. Subscribe to our channel and hit the bell icon if you want to see more videos like this on your feed.